Jenkins. What is Jenkins? It is an automation tool. We can use this to automate the build, deploy and testing in software li development lifecycle. It helps in continuous integration and continuous delivery. Jenkins supports many version control tools like SVN, CVS, Git, RTC, etc. It also supports some build scripts, for example, Ant, etc. How to install Jenkins? Download the installation package from Jenkins website. Click on the installation package and follow the instructions. Associate the Windows user account to the Jenkins service. Jenkins runs as a Windows service. Set the port number. These are the steps we follow while installing. Once the installation is complete, Jenkins is ready to use. How to open the Jenkins? Open the browser and enter HTTP colon, then the host, here in this case localhost, then colon port. Whatever this port you set that you enter here. It can be 8080, 80081 like that. Now I'll go to Jenkins website. Jenkins. Here I download. Choose the OS. This is the Windows OS. We are installing in Windows. The version is 2.375.2. Click on Windows, it will start downloading the package. It's downloading now. Now the package is downloaded. I'll open the folder containing this package. Click here, rubber clicking on the package. Next, I'll keep the same path program files in Jenkins. Next, here we need to choose the account, run service as local or domain user. Now I'll choose the account here. Uh, I'll open my user accounts available. I'll choose that account here, whatever account available in the system. I'll use that. I'll go to the users, local users, users. I have this user. I'll use this account Prashant and password associated with this. Now I'll open the installation one, add username and the password for that user. Enter test credentials. If it is proper, it show valid here. If it is, I change some value here. Test credentials showing error logging Prashant. Prashant is the system, then slash is the user, the username password incorrect. I need to enter the proper password for this user. This user password should be proper here. Now I entered that. I will test credentials done. Then next. Now we will have the port number here. So here by default it takes 8080. Now this is available. If it is not there, we can go for other ports like 8081, 8082 like that. Now this is fine 8080. Now next. Here it's taking the default uh, Java. So please select the path of the Java development kit. This is the prerequisite for Jenkins. Java should be there here. Now already it's selected. I'll keep the same thing JDK. Next. Here start service is selected i'll keep as it is and click next here now install jenkins it is throwing this error service jenkins failed to start verify that you have sufficient privileges to start system services this jenkins will work as a system windows service now we'll check i'll just retry it again if it is not working i'll go to services and check why it's not starting it is not starting i'll go to services 
सर्च फॉर जंकिन्स हियर द जंकिन्स जंकिन्स ऑटोमेशन सर्वर द स्टेटस इज नॉट स्टार्टेड हियर एंड द यूजर नेम टेकन इज प्रशांत हियर नाउ आई विल ट्राई टू स्टार्ट दिस आई ओपन दिस सर्विस स्टार्ट द सर्विस डिड नॉट स्टार्ट ड्यू टू लॉग ऑन फेल्यूर जस्ट चेक द लॉग ऑन अगेन इज द प्रशांत आई विल एंटर द आई विल ब्राउज अगेन दिस द यूजर नेम वी गिवन द लोकेशन इज प्रशांत दिस सिस्टम देन द यूजर नेम चेक द नेम इज अवेलेबल इट्स अवेलेबल ऑन दिस सिस्टम ओके देन द पासवर्ड आई गिव इट अगेन confirm apply okay now try to start the service start it now the service is in running state now i'll go back to the setup and retry now it is started finish the installation now now the jenkins is installed now how to access this jenkins go to the browser and here type http colon then the local host it is in our local host then the port is 8080 hit enter now jenkins is asking for the initial password here we need to add the password here unlock jenkins to ensure jenkins is securely set up by the administrator a password has been written to the log and this file is on the server so this initial password is there i'll open this password i'll op i'll open the path here initial admin password i'll open this file you'll get the password so this is the password here copy this password and enter here admin trader password continue now the jenkins is unlocking it's unlocked now now these are the customization you, you can do this later use the username admin and the administrator password you use to access the set now the jenkins is open now you can configure the jenkins based on your need here you can see it's logged in as admin user here the password for this is this is the one initial admin password now let's log out and log in again and i'll log in name as admin and password is this one i'll copy this and paste here sign in now it's logged in 